Hello, so today is... I am on the mark now, finally. Uh, I haven't posted a video in a very long time because I just didn't feel the need to, also because no big changes ever even happened. Um, but I thought since the three month mark is a pretty big deal uh, for, you know, putting down like certain dates, like like one month, two months, now three months. I didn't do my two month month one recording it on here because I thought it wasn't much change. I didn't notice anything. You probably won't notice anything. Um, so today marks three months on T. Uh, I am still in the patch, but I am getting a call from my doctor tomorrow because I'm going to switch from the patch to the injections because the patch are killer. They are death and at first, I had no problem with it, totally fine with it, uh, until probably about three weeks in, and they were killer. They were, you know, irritating my skin to the point of I was literally, like, scratching my skin off, and uh, I was bleeding, and it was not fun. Uh, it's still not fun. It's still super itchy because they need, the, the patches need to irritate the skin so it can actually, the testosterone can go into your skin, and I don't much appreciate that. So, we're going to switch to, in to the uh, injections uh, just because it's, it's quicker and I don't need it every day. Um, but the sucky part is, is that going on injections, I probably need to learn how to do it myself like right off the bat because the pharmacy that's right down the street, like the only closest one near me, uh, will not do the injections and I have no idea why. So that's kind of a... a, a a bump in the road, but like we'll get over it. Um, so I, so either I have to drive into the city, uh, every four weeks or so, or whenever, how long, or however they prescribe the injections, or I learn to do it myself, which will probably be the thing that I have to do, or go to the next town over and go to their pharmacy. But I hardly doubt they'll do it as well because they're the only other like drugstore they have there are shoppers um we have Rexall here so we'll see if that will do anything I'll probably have to do it myself um some days I'm like yeah I can do these injections I can just inject it in my leg and it'd be no problem I know there's a lot more but like in my mind it's it seems a lot more easier to do that and uh for um and then some days it's just like I don't know if I can like stick a a, a needle in my leg like I when I go get blood drawn like you can't see it right now because it, it's finally faded it, last week I got blood drawn and she pulled it out funny and my arm like bruised up hardcore and swelled luckily it healed up because I am getting another tattoo but anyways off the point I'm fine with needles uh but uh you know I'm fine with needles being put into my body because I get blood drawn every uh, six months, three months, and every four weeks, so you kind of have to get used to needles, uh, which I've always been fine with needles, but I think the point that I, you know, you have to inject it yourself, like I've watched, um, uh, I watch a lot of FTM videos of people actually injecting it into their skin so I can get used to it, still not used to it, mm -mm. um, so that's always fun, so we'll talk to the doctor, uh, I have to I, I can't get on to the injections until next week or the week after that because I am flying out tomorrow to back to Vancouver, good old Vancouver, um, to shoot a wedding. So I won't be here to, you know, change my prescription to the injections. So I'll still be on the patch during my stay. Uh, but once I get back, hopefully my prescription is ready or I have an appointment set to go in, get, you know, taught how to do this injection, and then, you know, carry on back, so, um, but I think it was a good try to try the patches out, because, uh, you know, a lot of people say they irritate, and I was like, mm, probably not, um, but, uh, I don't have very sensitive skin, so the fact that, that these patches, like, they didn't, they didn't hurt until, like, maybe three weeks or more into the, sorry, just having ginger ale, and exploding inside, um, when it happened three weeks into it or more, that it just started to irritate and irritate and irritate, so I thought, you know what, this is getting a little out of hand, 
you know, I have welts all over my leg because I can't seem to put it, I can't put it on my arms because it just flares up so bad and it gets so itchy that I want to rip it off so fast. Um, I tried my back, didn't work. Tried my abdomen, didn't work because, you know, I'm always slouching and stuff. And uh, so the only possible places were the thighs, and they're getting completely covered. Like, I have, uh, I'm lucky that, you know, some of the spots are fading. Like, you can still see them, but enough that I can put another one on top because it's been that long. Um, but they do take a very, very long time to fade away. Some of them aren't even faded away. I have scars now from scratching so hard. It's, it's a pain in the butt, so hopefully I can get these injections rolling. Um, nails are super long. Uh, these have to stay long until August at least, because we're going to Anime Thon and I'm going as Inuyasha, and I do not want to do with fake nails, false nails, fake nails. Yes, because they're a pain in the ass, and like I understand, like these ones will like hurt obviously if they bend, but with these ones with fake nails, like they just oh, they're just a pain. And like these ones, they're at this nice size that I want, and I'm not really good at shaping, you know, fake nails. So I thought, you know what, let's just grow these out, keep them this long, hopefully till August. We have like two more months until uh, Animathon, so hopefully these will stay intact. Uh, but anyways, that's my that that was longer than I thought it would be. But I thought I'd explain, you know, what's happened during this time. Uh, so this is my three, this is my voice, three months on tea. Sorry, I didn't do it beforehand. Um, it does sound a bit raspy right now, uh, a little bit more than usual. Because one, I'm talking way more than I, than I usually do. And I was just playing with my friend, we we're playing video games, and, uh, we get very rowdy. <laughs> uh, not against each other, we're, we're doing a team thing, but, uh, yeah, we, we have an interesting, uh, uh, way to play games, so yeah, that's all. So I'll probably do an update three months after this, I guess. If anything happens, I'll update this. But for now, I, I think I'm just more focused on the voice. No facial hair, so at all, which I already knew was gonna happen. Like, I mean, yeah, it's only three months. I get like a little bit here. Like, very, very, very little. Like, you have to be very, very close to look at it. Um, I've shaved it, like, maybe a couple of times, but that's about it. So, yeah, that's about it. So, hope you all get having a good night. So, I'll hopefully post this before midnight so I'm actually on time. Okay. Bye.